Pipeliner allows you to have multiple pipelines. This enables you to keep track of more than one process in your company. To switch to another pipeline, click this gear button and here you can switch from pipeline to pipeline. It's that easy. To move an opportunity to next pipeline, just open it and here, next to current pipeline, hit this change button. Now, in this pop-up, you can choose which pipeline you want to move this opportunity to, at what step, and even change the sales unit or owner. Now, when I switch to that pipeline, I see my opportunity here. To create a new pipeline, click your profile icon and hit Administration, and then in left menu, click Pipelines. Here you see all your current pipelines that can be edited by clicking this pencil icon. But we will add new pipeline here. Name your pipeline and choose the color. Here are your sales steps. Name them and set the probability of closure for each. You can't have less than three sales steps. Add new steps with this green plus button or here. Optionally, you can arrange them as needed and hit save. I won't edit the opportunity form now. Now here is my pipeline. Let's edit it. Here, I can edit the stage properties and enable the sales velocity. Once enabled, Pipeliner will notify you about opportunities that are stalled for longer than this period of time. You can attach sales steps documents like call scripts or email templates, and here you set sales activities that sales reps should complete in this stage before moving to next one. To set who will have access to what pipeline, click here and then Roles. Create a new role here or like me, edit the existing one here. I will scroll down to the bottom and choose here what pipelines this role can have access to and hit save. And lastly, you need to assign a user to this role. Go to Users and edit the user you want. In this pop-up, just change his role and it's done. That easy. Click here to start your free trial. Or click on one of these to see how Pipeliner can help you with other tasks.